What's good YouTube? It's your girl Bofina One bringing you guys in another YouTube video and today I'm talking about YouTubers and how many of them are suffering from demonetization slash loss of views. However, one YouTuber in particular, Philip DeFranco, made a video the other day discussing how bad YouTube is hitting him with demonetization and view suppression. I'll start with what is frustrating, which is that as of right now, with the current state of YouTube, the Philip DeFranco show cannot thrive. Uh, in fact, I think very, very soon the Philip DeFranco show may not be able to survive. View suppression is when a video is not appearing for a particular creator's regular viewers on their homepage, on trending, or on the recommendation tab. The problem with this is your core audience may not even be receiving notifications or may not even see when you upload, allowing for a viewer suppression, which is why many channels have seen such a large decrease in their viewership. YouTube is not hiding the videos, but making it harder for people to find. And we all know how people are, you know, they're lazy. They're not going to search too much further than the first, maybe second page. Philip DeFranco has claimed to have lost anywhere between 300,000 to 450,000 views. Philip DeFranco says, in quotes, as of right now, with the current state of YouTube, the Philip DeFranco show cannot thrive. In fact, I think very soon the Philip DeFranco show may not be able to survive. It all really boils down to the increased crackdown from YouTube against this channel. Close quotes. The thing is, when making videos for a living and all of a sudden your money is cut short or you're not making anything for all the time you put in, yes, it's going to be frustrating. And yes, these creators are living a certain lifestyle that requires money as well. And this is the thing that kind of kills me is people always complain about, you know, oh, they make all this money. They make all this money. Well, look at it this way. Where I'm from, minimum wage is $10 an hour. So let's say you work 40 hours a week, but you get paid for 37.5. Okay, so that's $375 a week, $750 every two weeks. Okay, now your job says you're gonna be paid $8 an hour versus $10 an hour. Now that's $300 a week, $600 every two weeks. So, you know, that could be a bill, that's groceries, that's whatever. So you have to keep that in mind before you start complaining about YouTubers making all this money. Yes, they do, but it's the same as you just on a bigger scale. And for those who don't know, channels like Philip DeFranco that are kind of like news channels, there's a lot of other behind the scene people that they have to pay for in order to, you know, make their edits good, to make the studio look good, to be able to pick up audio. You know, it's not just him recording. It's a whole bunch of other processes, other steps that go into it. So that's something that you guys also need to keep in mind. Um, when you see these high quality channels, these high quality, you know, like really high quality videos, it's not like, oh, they just poof. You know, it, it's a lot of time. It's a lot of other stuff. They may have a graphic designer, someone that makes their thumbnails. They may have someone that edit their videos, you know, so these people got to get paid too. So it's not like it's just one person necessarily doing everything. So yeah, guys, that's the news and what's going on with Philip DeFranco as well as just YouTube in general. Um, I know today I had a problem with my views. I had uploaded a video and literally people were watching it and commenting and liking, but the view count was not updating. So, I mean, that's another form of view suppression. People are not getting my stuff. And I mean, it's just, it's just getting to that point where it's just like, I just don't know where YouTube is getting ready to go. It, it sounds like they're just trying to kick out their content creators, really, the people that are the core of the community. So, you know, I'd love to have a discussion about this down below in the comment section. So as always, guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll talk to you later. Peace, Fan Army.